Hello again YouTube. Just decided to bring you out into the woods just to demonstrate a simple and easy means of water filtration. I would use one item that would be in any survival kit and something you may very possibly have with you anyway. And the two items are I assume you can see that okay. Tampon, which should be in any survival kit. And uh, just a juice bottle. This one ideally has a, ideally for this, but it doesn't need to be, sports cap. So I'll now go about showing you how it's uh, constructed. Yep, and uh, this is pretty much the completed system. I've literally just cut the top off the bottle. And a bottle this size, I might just cut it near the end, but if it's a larger bottle you could uh, use that as a drinking vessel. And I moistened the uh, tampon in a little water and so it filled up the neck of the bottle. And as you can see that is in the bottom there. Now I'll uh, show you how it works. Well, she near got a pretty decent river there actually, but I thought that'd be a bit easy, so I'm just going to demonstrate on this rather marshy groundwater. Well, as you can see, it's not great water, is it? Hopefully. Yeah, this is actually going to be quite difficult to do with one hand, as I'm obviously holding the camera with the other, but if we just pour our water in. I can just see how much sediment's in that, can't you? Well, I spilt some of it, but never mind. The other advantage of sports cap is you can uh, stand it up <laughs> and, you know, and it's not actually flowing till you want it to, but just have to go out a shot while I undo it. And uh, yeah, it'll slowly drip through. And I don't know if you can see into the aluminium container that well, but it's relatively clear. It's a bit well from what it is anyway. There's a... It's certainly not the nicest water ever, but... I think you can see the picture. I mean, if this was ideally boiled, maybe with chlorine tablets, it should still be safe to drink. Obviously this filter wouldn't remove any bacteria or viruses from the water, but it will certainly get rid of silt and most of the most sediment. Anyway, thank you for watching and I hope this has been useful to someone. Yeah, I thought this would be the end of the video, but um, when I noticed this, I thought I'd just uh, tack this bit on the end. Look into the bottom of this uh, bottle, now it's empty. You can see just how much of the um, sediment I originally poured in, and how much of it it's um, stopped. I don't know if you can see... Let's try and point out with my little finger here, the line through the clear plastic, you can actually see... Not much is actually flowing around the outside of the tampon, so it's actually quite an efficient particle filter.